Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> oh, Canada, our home and busing land. Get a cameo now while I'm in Canada while you can. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are starting with a random mini travel vlog to upstate New York. In particular, Messina. First we had to pass through the Aquasasne Mohawk Reserve though, and then cross a bridge to get to the USA border. Okay, we made it through. I had no specific reason to come here today. I just like checking it out every few years to see if anything has changed. I also love driving around to nowhere and anywhere at any given time. Question for Americans, is Dollar General, like, a really good dollar store? Alright, so we have here a little shopping mall with a Chinese buffet, a cinema, a big lots, hmm, interesting. Alright, so this is what's playing at this cinema. Is this old movies? I can't tell. So I didn't notice this until it was too late, but the crappy gas station car charger I purchased wasn't working and therefore wasn't charging my phone this whole time. So at some point my battery died and thus why the vlog of Messina was no more. But I didn't want to waste the whole trip, so I'm still sharing the clips I have. Sorry guys. Anyways, unfortunately, things recently have taken a bit of a toll for the worse health-wise. Hello. So, as you can see, I'm in the ER beezing. Um, I have norovirus or the, um, the bad stomach flu, the highly contagious one. I don't know where I got it. I hope I never get it again. It is the worst illness. I swear, it's it's disgusting. So I became severely dehydrated. And so I, I got sick about, I don't know, maybe three days ago. I don't remember exactly when, a few days ago and I woke up in the middle of the night and I had to throw up. TMI, by the way. And then the other, other end, diarrhea, severe diarrhea. So vomiting, diarrhea, muscle weakness, just um, fatigue. I'm very dehydrated. My sodium and um, the chloride, I don't know, my electrolytes were bad. I couldn't keep enough water in, like fluids in, at the rate they were going out. It's bad, it's bad. Don't come near me, you'll catch it. <laughs> anyway, just a quick update. Um, I'm doing all right other than that. Um, you know, oh no, the arm cuff thing, it hurts, the blood pressure cuff, let's see what my blood pressure is, you'll love, I don't know what's going on, anyways, 
so I gotta get a whole bunch of fluids. Um, going to the bathroom is torture because I have to unplug everything and take this thing with me into the bathroom. Oh, I'm tired all the time. So I'm just trying to get better and then we should be able to do a bit of beezing. Yeah, I'm very dizzy and just weak. They want me to try to tolerate food. I haven't eaten in like since being sick pretty much. I tried having like an apple because I can't drink. I don't know where people come with up with like ginger ale soda when you're sick. There's nothing I want less than soda. Um, my wedding ring fell off in the shower. That's because I'm like, I'm being a skinny queen from the norovirus. <laughs> I had to do some cameos from my hospital bed. Fun times. Anyway. Not fun. I don't know, you, did you guys get the gastro this, this year? I haven't had that in forever. Oh my gosh. Seriously, it is the worst, man. So, it feels like a hangover times 10. That's what it feels like. Ew. So yeah, I didn't want saltines and ginger ale. Like, I wanted juicy fruit because I was so thirsty. Anyway, my blood sugar's through the roof even though I didn't eat. The doctor's like, well, it's probably be because of the stress of being sick and if you have like a virus or infection, you know. Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys. I'm sorry, but I don't know what, what will be going on, how long I'll be here for. in case the doctor's coming. <laughs> yeah, so they keep coming and checking my electrolyte levels, my blood sugar, stuff like that. So I'll keep you guys updated. Sorry for the bad quality video, but... <sighs> I just want to sleep till this is over. Honestly, it's the worst feeling. I can't even think of food. Yeah, and I know you're thinking, well, this is just what you need. Maybe. Yeah, my wedding ring fell off in the shower. I'm skinny now. <laughs> I'm definitely not putting any crap in my body after this. Uh, the way I feel... I don't think I can tolerate it, honestly. They want me to try to tolerate something before I leave here. So who knows what that will be. I can't. <laughs> Anyways, guys. <laughs> Yay for norovirus. Ew. Have to have my own washroom because it's contaminated from my from me because it's so highly contagious. Anyway, I'm gonna try to rest. And um I'll just see you guys when I see you, I guess. I don't know. I'll try to update you guys as I can. Um, see you later. Bye. So they ended up having to give me a total of six of these fluid bags for uh, rehydration. It was rough. Hi guys. I just wanted to give an update basically on, you know, I left kind of hanging in the ER. So I have been discharged. I was discharged in like the middle of the night and I actually feel a lot better today. So basically I was just really dehydrated, like a lot. So basically they gave me like um, a few liters of fluid anyways. I've been drinking, I picked up some Gatorade, but it's like, it's like a healthy Gatorade because when I'm ill, Gatorade is like real Gatorade is too artificial for me. And that's why I don't like ginger ale either when I'm sick. <laughs> So it's actually only got like, I think two or three carbs and one gram of sugar, which is also good for diabetics, you know, and it's made with like real, I think it's like watermelon juice and like, um, salts, like sea salt and like more natural ingredients. There's still a few that are a little iffy, but it's for the most part, they're very, 
uh, they're a lot more natural, let's just say. So I was just charged in the middle of the night, which, um, you know, they asked me if I was okay. And I said, yeah, I can drive. <laughs> That's about it. Today I'm feeling a lot better. I think the hydration really helped. And honestly, I was, um, I'm, I'm really craving like pickle juice, which also is apparently good for like electrolyte replenishment. Uh, because of the high sodium content but like I was just like craving going into like you know a Canadian grocery store like no frills and just grabbing like no name brand big jar of dill pickles and just downing the juice like having an emergency jar of pickles in my bag that's not a bad idea anyway I should start a pickle company who am I kidding I can't even get up before noon on a good day or before three well sometimes yes I've been sleeping a lot, like for days, I've just been resting in that because this flu just makes you feel like you've been hit by a mock truck, like 18 wheeler. So yeah, fun, fun. Anyway, um, I'm sticking around for a little while because I had some plans that were like pre-booked with like, you know, um, friends and family. Yeah, I have friends. You guys are always shocked by that. I don't have many, but... <laughs> Actually, I do have a lot. I just don't keep in touch with a lot of them. So, yeah. But uh, I have some things to take care of, some medical appointments and things like that. So, um, I will probably, like, do some live streams. I'm not sure. And I'll do some more videos for you guys, more vlogs. But I am still going back to Kuwait. And um, so I'm just, like, rearranging my life right now, basically. And I'm just overwhelmed. Like and just having the personal space like not uploading as frequently is like really helping so I appreciate your guys's patience I know a lot of you look forward to and depend on my videos um so yeah so I'll be back whenever I can <laughs> see you guys bye masalama